Right behind me is a tuk-tuk, and it's one of the ways you can actually experience this town. We're going to do just that with our driver. We're going to spend the next few hours exploring some of the ins and outs of what you can see and do in CM Reef. market in Siem Reap and you literally have people selling fish and vegetables and fermented fish uh, right next to the guys selling backpacks, baseball caps, sandals, Nikes, you name it. buy chicken in the States, right? Well, does it come with the feet attached and the legs like this? Probably not. And here in this market, they literally give you an open view into the chicken itself. Take a look here. This reminds me of my AP biology class in high school where we dissected animals, because I can see literally all the major organs of this particular guy who's seen better days. This is Artisans Anchor. It's a collective that was started in 1992. How does it work? They actually send tests out to folks in the countryside who have some artistic ability. They take a test, and if they pass that test, they could be invited here to spend one year honing their craft. We're actually going to take a walk around to the various workshops here and see exactly what they do. We're entering the silk painting workshop. What they'll literally do is paint directly on silk, but what's unique about this workshop is that all of the artists that you see here are deaf and mute. So explain what, what you do right here. Um, here we have a compressed wood. And after that, and um, we're painting with the lacquer on the compressed wood. So the compressed wood, yeah. and you use an etching, some type of etching. How does that work? A lacquer okay. painting. Okay, so you lacquer paint the yeah. compressed wood, and, and then you then take... The stencil. Okay. We have the stencil, and after that, we have the chalk powder. Okay. Just that we wrap on the stencil like that. When we take it out, and we will see the line on it here. And that's how they actually will then paint. Yeah, after that, I'll be painting with the varnish. It's down here with the varnish, mm -hmm. down here. And after the varnish, and then we put in with the copper. This is the copper. Then we stick on it here like that. And it sticks, and then become like this. OK, very neat. This is the final. And so you, like so that. you're seeing the whole process here. Yes.
What this gentleman right here is working on is a piece of soapstone. He's actually doing some rough carving to get a general shape. Once he gets that general shape, you end up with this. It's basically kind of looks like an elephant. But that's when the artist really gets to work. And as you see this gentleman right here, he's hand carving the details of this elephant and you can literally see it coming together. Artisan's Angkor is a wonderful stop and a must stop when you do come to see him reap because you will see things being made before your eyes and will also have an opportunity to stop in the gift shop and buy some of these wonderful, wonderful items to remember your trip to Cambodia.